Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back. My name is Ariel and this is day 10 of my 25 days of Christmas playlist. I will have the playlist linked below, but I'm going to make some Christmas trees today. So all of these trees are going to be using Dollar Tree products. This particular tinsel tree, however, my, I got from the thrift store because my Dollar Tree did not yet have their tinsel trees in. And I did have to do a couple of repairs to the frame of it, but other than that, it was pretty much the same as what you would get at the Dollar Tree. I spray painted it white because I knew I would be wrapping it with the feather boas from the children's section. I believe I used about three packs of the feather boas. So when you're finished wrapping it, it's not really going to have much of a shape. You are going to need to trim it down in order to get that nice cone shape back. Sorry that the background's kind of dark, but this is going to be perfect to go along with my flock decor this year. It just gives that really nice fluffy texture, almost like snow. For the next one, I'm doing something fairly basic um, by just adding some green yarn to the cone shape, but I did add on a little bit of embellishment, and you'll see that in a minute to make it a little bit different. And for some reason, this tree really gives me the Whoville vibes from the Grinstitch Till Christmas. I feel like that would be a really nice Christmas theme. It's not something that I would do, but I did see when I was shopping around this year. I have a bunch of Shop With Me videos in my 25 Days of Christmas playlist. And if you check those videos, there's actually a lot of decor out this year that reminded me of the Grinstitch Till Christmas. So... This year would be perfect if you wanted to do a theme like that for Christmas. And for this last one, I'm actually using some cups from the catering section, a wooden dowel, and the silver spoons. I actually just clipped off the edges of those to get a straight silver piece on the end and then glued those around. And just so you know, those are the mini forks and spoons from the catering section, not the full size ones. I was left with a little bit of white showing at the top so to cover that and to top it off I just used a little berry that I had from some random pick. And this is what it all looks like after giving it a coating of gold spray paint. For the last one, I'm trying to channel those like modern wood slat Christmas trees. Actually, I don't even know if they have these, but I just know that this modern wood slat design is pretty popular this year, so I wanted to kind of try to make that into a Christmas tree. 
So for this, I'm using the cups again, and then I'm just going to use these wooden pop mini popsicle sticks, I guess you would call them, from my local dollar store. But for the top of this one, I'm actually using a miniature funnel instead of the foam cone for the top part of the tree and just wrap, I clipped off the end of the funnel, the long skinny part of the funnel, and then added on the wooden, top, the wooden sticks. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider subscribing. I do budget-friendly home decor and home improvement, as well as shop with me videos, thrift lips, and hauls. And you'll find all of that sort of content for Christmas on my 25 Days of Christmas playlist. Please consider subscribing. Leave me a like and a comment below. Have a wonderful holiday.